Hello everybody and welcome back to Secret of Mana uh, 2. The, you know, the second one. I forgot what the game was doing there. It's really hard to tell, obviously. It's, uh, it's a very samey looking game. I thought it was the newest Call of Duty game. Anyway, we have to go to the Island of Oblivion because uh, with such a lovely name, who wouldn't want to go? That's where the mana gates are that go to the mana land where the mana tree likes to drink some mana tea to have a bit of a mana fun time. Or some shit. Uh, how do I get out of this damn forest? I think we go this way. Yeah, this looks, this looks likely. Let's just beat the shit out of these dudes. Come on. Ain't got no got time for your sass, little weird crawler creatures. Thank you very much. Yeah, get started on. Damn right. We could actually farm here for ages. It's something I probably should have done. But I can always come back. That's the beauty of these games. I mean, I probably won't. Because I bet the mana place would be better. But the point being is I could have done. Right. Let's use Angela's amazing fingers. And her ability to hold a tune. We'll call... Is it Bobosco? Schlobolo? Geralt? Ah, here's Geralt. Which is always, uh... Always fulfill their contracts. He regrets this one. Alright. The Island of Oblivion, which we accidentally settled on last time, because, uh, I don't know, I, I was like, hmm, what is this mysterious island in the middle of the world? And, uh, went in there. And it was nice! There we go, it's got sad music. But now we're ready! We're ready to be sad. See? We're here, finally! Now, come on, let's open the gate to the Holy Land. <laughs> I couldn't have done it without your help. Thank you for everything. The power of mana has been declining, but I think we've arrived just in time. Spirits, please help me. This is the scene from Link's Awakening where all the instruments come out, right? Ah, now's the time to give you my strength. Let's do it. I can't remember what voice I gave all these guys. I'm so sorry. Here we go. I'm with you. Oh, look at that. It's like a roll call. I summon the powers of darkness. I'll do what I can. We're the last! Come on! I don't know, but I'll try. Look at these little dancing trees, isn't that nice? I mean, I would have just set like an elevator in there or something, but... You know, whatever works, I guess. Why do magical areas never have just a friggin' normal door or something? It's always weird shit to get in there. See, this is just a design flaw. If you want your world to be fixed, you need to have like a world engineering room or some shit, you know? Don't don't let magical trees not have a magical maintenance bay. Hey, you almost got it. Try it again. Almost there. Try it again. Almost, but don't worry. Carly is here watching over you. Thank you, everyone, but the mana isn't strong enough. I'm going to try one more time. Goddess, give me your strength. Oh. Come on, we don't get to this part of the adventure and have you fail on us, fairy. We collected all the eight watsets and now we're here. Oh, nice. Da 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 da. Did, did, did that work? Yay! Nothing seems to have changed. I'll just. They know, they know what's going on. I'll take their word for it. You guys didn't do anything. You can stop flicking your hair. Wait, no, it wasn't me. I didn't do anything. The gate opened itself? That could only mean. The energy from the mana stones has been released. Their power combined with mine. That's why the gate rose up into the sky. Oh no. Not mother. Yes, mother. World's worst parent. Ready to sacrifice her daughter. She appears on airship over the mana land. It's very sinister. I guess we need to see that she came, in fact, from her homeland, which we know because we've been there. But thank you for reminding me where the Queen of Reason comes from. And yes, here comes the Queen of Bad Shit Insanity, ready to land in the Manor Holy Land. With her magical airship, presumably powered by the power of magic. Dun 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 dun! Look out! Oh no, she's blowing us up. Man, she really doesn't care about her own daughter. <laughs> that voice, it's Corrin. Then the ship must be the magic fortress. Gigantus? Ugh. <laughs> Thanks to the spirits, we were finally able to release the energy from the mana stones. 
Now we can fly the Gigantus Ugh. into the gate. Oh, by the way, here's a present from me. I didn't name the ship. Ow! That hit my bum. Ooh. Ha 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 ha. I'm so evil. I don't know how you can hear me, but I equipped a megaphone on the ship. I hope it worked. Yes. My dear beastmen and the Beast King, the gate to the Holy Land is open. This is our chance to take the Sword of Mana from the Game Boy Advance and crush the savage humans with it once and for all, with its excessive bloat and interesting storylines. Yes, don't you agree, my lord? Do as you see fit. That's what I like to hear. Mm. My dear beastmen, let us disembark. A new era for the Beast Kingdom is nigh at hand. Everybody's arrived. Look at this, it's a big shindig and everybody's turned up. They don't need no ship, they just got flying eagles, which they're traversing half the world on. You think you would get tired, that's quite a long way. But that's fine, they've got really strong arm muscles. Good work, guys. I mean, I would have I gone by boat to the edge of the land, then flown, maybe? But you know, I'm not a beast man, maybe they're, maybe they're okay with that. I actually really like the whole all the bad guys get here thing. It really keeps them in the story. Hey, it's Big U. Yagen, what's wrong? The gate to the Holy Land has opened ahead of schedule. I trust everything is ready. What do you mean? Of course we're ready. How is the Dark Prince doing? Not well, I'm afraid. He passed away in his attempt to open the gate himself. I see. Then everything is according to plan. I prepared an airship to enter the gate. If we don't succeed, then we'll never be able to revive the Dark Prince, or the Underworld. So the Underworld of Moldova is really big in the mana games that aren't Mana 1, and it's really weird, and if you've never played any of the others, it always is all like, bleh. But Sword of Mana's got quite big about it as well. The Dark Prince, Dark Lord, they're all part of this uh, Underworld. Count Lee. If you've seen Kiko's Let's Play of the original, you would know some, like, you'd recognise Dark Lord and, Dark, and uh, Count Lee, I'd imagine. They're Moldovans, they're like weird vampire-like creatures. I'm not sure if that's what Big U is, or she's been empowered by them. Um, there is a slight reference to them in Secret Mana 1. A Grepalon, I think, the creature... And I can't remember if it's Geshtar or Fana. No, Fana transforms as well, actually. I think Geshtar and Fana... Is it Geshtar? Was it Fan? No, it's not Thanatos. Let me have a think a minute. Sorry, give me a sec. So, Thanatos is the Lich. So, he's part of the Maldovan underworld as well. Um... Sheik is Sheik, isn't it? She so Sheik transforms into the Grepalon through the power of the Underworld. He says that's the Maldovan power he's been granted. It's a contract he has with them. Um, Fana does the same thing, where she transforms into the Hexen with the four arms. It's all part of this big overarching storyline. The only thing is, it wasn't part of it when they wrote it. I assume that all the translation job that Wolsey did, Ted Wolsey, didn't include that. Not that I'm saying he did a bad job at all. With the time he had, he did an amazing job. It's just that you know, it's missing some context probably. Anyway. Come on, everyone. It was only a cannon shot from a friggin' airship. You're alright. Is everyone okay? Yeah, we're fine. Oh no! We have to follow them before it's too late. But how are we gonna get there? The gate is too high for us to reach. I've heard of a creature that lives at the peak of the highest mountain. The father of the winged ones. Legend has it, the goddess herself rode the creature's back. Highest mountain, huh? Jose told me about geography, but I never paid attention. Hmm. Was it maybe Rolante? Well, let's go there and find out. Yeah, we can't do anything here because we can't fly. This is why you make gates so accessible. Alright, let's go call Geralt and get out of here. Ugh, I'm the Witcher Gliven. I'm here to take you places. Don't you mean Geralt? Yeah, that's it. Here he comes. That's the worst contract I've ever had. Goddamn portals. Right. So, to Rolante. Oh god, I don't know where bloody Rolante is. I think it's in the mountains in the bottom left sort of area. Well, no, the, mid the middle bottom area. I'm not 100% on that, so we'll, we'll see if we can find it. We'll know if we get the right one, because it's the path to the heavens. Because we'll hear the music. Uh, so, I guess keep an eye out for mountains and... I'm trying to think where it is. This is it, isn't it? This is the base of it, so did I, did I miss the beach? I don't think I missed the beach, did I? Uh, I 
No, I didn't I didn't miss a beach. There's no beach here. Okay, cool. Right, so it's gotta be around here somewhere. Okay, keep an eye out folks. Gotta spot us a beach. Well there's the island. There's the town. I'm 90%. It might, there's a beach on the other side. I wanna miss that. This might not be the right one. It might be the one further down. Well that's the that's the fire coming with the desert, wasn't it? You know, considering we got an interactive map, a little dot wouldn't have gone on this. <laughs> Jeez. Especially it seems we can only land in certain places. Right. Uh, oh my god, have I really got to go around the entire way? Are you kidding me? Jeez. Uh, what's this? No, this is the desert, so it's definitely- No, I don't want to land here. No! No! I didn't push a button! God damn it. Come on, Geralt. We ain't done with you yet. Normally this is the sort of bit I would cut out, and uh, obviously I wouldn't make you sit here and watch this through me, but this is one of these instances where I decide if I'm suffering, so is everybody. Oh yeah, if we're using Geralt to find our way around. I'm guessing we gotta go all the way around, in which case I should have gone backwards as opposed to this way. So, we know it's not this area. So, I think it's... Because this is all the desert area. Oh, so the beast we can fly. The lady has a freaking fortress. Death Jester gets there somehow. Oh, maybe this is it actually. Ah, this could be it. Let's find out. Score. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yep, found it. Right, let's go to Rolante. So they should have it back now. Level 8? Yeah, lol. Okay, GTFO, guys. Uh, how does one get to... Oh, up this way. Okay, so Rolante is just heading straight up, isn't it? Since Elise has the castle back now, it should be nice and easy. And, of course, we haven't really got to worry about the baddies. Bop. Bop. So that was the way to the flower field, I think. So we want to go this way. Bop. Good work, team. Uh, ugh, no, that's this. That's the way to the flower field. Okay, so I, can't, I think we go to the top right. I think we just keep heading top right, like this all way. So we want to get to the drawbridge area, which should be around here. I think it's either this one or the next screen. Bob. Uh, must be the next one. We're at the top of the mountain now, at least. So, yeah, here we go. So, this is the drawbridge. I think we just go across the drawbridge into the main castle. Now, yeah, look at this guy. What a noob. 12 XP. I've been dealing with hundreds of XP. You guys suck. Eh. Eh. Wow, that zombie survived its attack. What the hell? Weird. Right. Finding back in Rolante. Oh, hello. Oh, hello, everyone. How have you been? The father of the winged ones? I understand. I'll open up the passage. The father of the winged ones is Rolante's guardian. He only opens his soul to our people. Be careful. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, that would have been helpful to know before. Thank you, Plot Amazon. The summit of the skies. Ooh, I like it. Hey! Level appropriate baddies. All right. So how appropriate are they? Let's find out. 144, that's very appropriate. Alright. They aren't particularly, while they're high level, they aren't particularly dangerous enemies, I don't think. Well, I guess we'll be looking around. Okay, the armor knights are pretty gribbly, so let's, uh, wind don't like, uh, wind didn't like, uh, diamonds, right? Let's find out. Splat, 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 splat. 92, okay, that's not the right thing. Not for him, anyway. Although he, does, he is heavily armoured, so it might- Oh no, I forgot about this! Oh, please don't hurt me too badly, sir. Uh, oh god! Everybody's dead! Everyone alright? Okay, well, let's let's heal that off, shall we? Well, that was unpleasant. Right, focus fire those ones then. Focus fire. We've learned a lesson here today. A valuable lesson that involves not getting murdered. Okay, there's a way to the south. What's over here? Just goes up. What's down to the south? 
Oh, just a room with dudes in it. All right, well, uh, we'll use wind. I, we'll try wind on them, I guess. I actually can't remember what I need to use for these guys. I mean, wind and earth are two sides of the same coin, so you think that... Uh, so that's 73 and 262. Well, he hates that. So if we alternate... Oh, they're both dead? Oh, no, they both hated that. Okay. All right, well... That was fun, guys. We should do that again sometime. Right, let's get this one instead. Should probably have found a save statue before we did this. Okay. Since the uh, wind magic just wrecked the armored knight really badly, we're just going to be doing that. Since they're the only real dangerous ones here at the moment that I've noticed, so... And the, t the harpy can get beaten up just by regular, regular slappage. Okay, I think I need to heal again. Damn it, Carly, you're so fragile. Nice. Beautiful. Eh. Uh, don't need you on screen. So, no, I don't think we'll just beat you up. Oh, hello. A round drop, but it's sent into storage. Do, 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 do. Alright. This seems like a long, thin path of uh, not a lot, but maybe there is the Father of the Heavens, or... Oh, maybe this is it. Since I'm not doing this, this isn't me. I'm, I'm not cool enough to make the stride of awesome. It's Flammy! Hey, Flammy! Look, it's the Father of the Wink... Huh? Uh, he's a little small to be called a father. Maybe he's a child? Son, can you fly us to the Manor Holy Land? Hey, is it alright? I think you made it angry. Oh, I know what the problem is. You're not a father at all. You're a girl! Well, in that case, you need a cuter name. Hmm, how does Flammy sound? I'm glad you like it. Now, Flammy, can you fly us to the Holy Land? There's not much time. Oh, we got Flammy back. Oh, Flammy. Look at this! We, we get flown automatically this time, I think. It's Flammy! Beautiful. We got a girl, Flammy. Yeah! These are the best things about the mana game, is getting the dragons. Love it. Whee! So much more animated as well, love it. So good. Fla Flammy, do you know where you're going? You're lost. Shit, we probably should have given the dragon a compass. Oh, here we go. Good work, Flammy. Whoa. Oh, wow, the Manor Holy Land's like a separate map. Hey, go figure. Kind of lucky we brought a flying dragon with us. Hey, straight at the tree. Good, Flammy. This is it. The Holy Land. Everyone's hurt. I hope Corrin didn't do this. Everyone's hurt, quote, quote. You mean dead? They look they look pretty dead to me. They've had a pretty nasty fight. Oh god, mega rabbi. It's a king rabbi! Quick, kill it with fire. Or diamonds in this case. Take this, king rabbi. Diamond shoved up your furry little hide. They're pretty strong. Rebellions are worth a lot of XP, actually. Oh god. 214 XP, that's a hardcore rat bite. I thought we landed at the damn tree. Damn it, Flammy. Okay, well, we can't go over there, so... Hold that thought, Rebellion. The Pure Land looks a little different than I last remember it. But then again, this is thousands of years in the past, so... So what's interesting in the Manor timeline, this happened. And then a great civilization rises, which makes which uses which utilizes the mana fortress. So they didn't really learn anything from all this. So never mind, I guess. Time was it? Time flows like a river, and history repeats. I guess that's the point of these games. Eh. Okay. Oh, there's a little little rabbi over there. He's gonna get dunked by the diamond missile. I don't think this is the most dangerous one, but I like it. I like the spell. It's a good spell. Bap, bap. There we go. Nice. So... I mean, this place is ancient at the best of times, isn't it? It's obviously seen better days. 
Let's go over here. This way looks cool. Oh, I should probably attack so the uh, my friends can get get moving. Not that Duran did anything. Well done, you. Freaking noob. Uh. Oh no, a rabbi rains. Oh god, it's raining bunnies. That's kind of cool, actually. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Right, let's kill it. Might need to heal. It's getting a bit shifty around here, isn't it? It's raining bunnies. Hallelujah. I wonder what makes this rabbi the king. I mean, there's lots of kings. Do they all vie for the position of rabbi king? Or is there a rabbit king hierarchy going on? Oh no, it's doing more bunnies! Oh, we killed it before the bunnies happened. Which just kind of makes me sad a little bit. Freaking hope the goddess can help us out when we get there. We are working for her, after all. This looks like the wrong way. I'm not sure how I like the level up sound being used as a freaking item sound. It makes me think I've leveled every single time. Okay, so this doesn't go anywhere, so I guess we can head the other way. Ah, the music's great as always. Come on, Durin. Kill the bunny. Kill the bunny. Durin, that bunny's doing a lot of damage. I kind of want a rabbi plushie. I'm going to have to look at that. <laughs> no, it's the rabbi. Oh, God. Bunnies everywhere. What does that even do? It doesn't seem to do anything. It looks cute though. Hey! Bunny jerk. If this isn't the right way either, I'm gonna be very confused. Probably means I'm missing something. I'm guessing the rabbis will be weak to Salamando. Or shade, maybe? Because it's. Are they classed as light elementals? Doing the Holy Land? I don't know. Try it, I suppose. Alright, I'm looking low on health again. Keep getting rabbi to the face. Let's quickly solve that. To be honest, the quick healing nature of this now makes it a lot easier just to uh, keep yourself topped up each screen. This looks suspiciously like a dead end. Just beat them up. Forcefully. Oh yeah, nice. This is a dead end. So we've hit two dead ends now. Hell. Must be another way to go somewhere then. Is there an up? No. There was a down over here? No, that was just that. So I guess we've missed something somewhere. I would suggest going the way we came, but... Right. Dude, I love that Jiren goes to the middle of the screen to do that. He's like, well, if I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it efficiently. Oh, we leveled up. Oh, nice. Higher in for me. Higher strength for you. Good work, team. Right, to make sure I'm not going insane, I'm going to check this screen to make sure we didn't miss anything. If not, we'll head back the way we came, and then, you know. I'm kind of wondering if we're supposed to look like those pillars, where we're supposed to, you know, um, use a spell or use a... It's the Rabbi Rainstorm! Wait, it didn't happen! Scam! I wanted my rabbis. There's no alternate way, and it was only this route that allowed us to progress. There was nothing here except for this. No. Okay, I'm not going mad. There is no other route here. Okay, well, that's kind of good to check, I suppose. I can't move through the trees or anything. Right, okay, fine. So that means we've got to go down and round or something, I suppose. Ah, that's good XP, at least. These things do absolutely tons of XP. I'm going to try Shade, actually. Let's try Evil Gate on these things. Evil Gate's an awesome looking spell as well. Uh, nah, it's about the same. I'm gonna try burning the rabbits next time. Which sounds very cruel, but... Ew. 
Uh, more spirit for you, some more healing. Glorious. Lovely. Well, since this way did not pan out at all, there must be another way to go. If this didn't pan out at all, then I have no idea, and I'm going to have to look around. Oh, I'm just dead. It's all good. Now it's dead. But we went this way at the start, and it just led to a dead end. What? Okay, now I'm freaking confused. Okay, then maybe there's an, an, a completely different way we could have gone at the start to avoid all this. Which doesn't make any sense to me, but... Well, there's this offshoot here. This also looks like a dead end to me, but... Oh no. Oh wait, yep. Can we, maybe we can go on the lily pads? No, okay, we can go on the lily pads. Right. Take this, Rabbi King. You don't deserve the title. Eh. Eh. Nice. Ah, oh, treasure chest. An angel scroll. I think I probably needed that. Okay, well this looks slightly more promising. Well, let's uh, right, let's let's burn the bunnies. Fireball. Come on, Salamando. Oh, just the one bunny. Oh, I usually get toasted bunny. Well, it did more damage to us one bunny, but. You know. Check to make sure there's no alternate pass. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Let's see what's over here then. Maybe this is the other route to where we would have gone. Uh, what else have we got? Dark forcing a bunny. Let's 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 uh, chubby mermaid some bunnies. Go, chubby mermaid. Clunk, clunk. I like that she shields us. That's nice. Yeah, that does. They all do roughly the same. I don't think the bunnies have any particular weakness, so I guess it's just whatever we prefer to use. This looks suspiciously like the same area. God damn it. Well, now I'm freaking confused. Maybe if I could go on the lily pads, I must have missed a lily pad somewhere then. In the water, in one of the areas. Well, there's definitely this... Okay. So it all leads to the same place. This is where we need to go, I think. But we can't get past this big friggin' block that's fallen over. Which is a nuisance. Maybe this isn't the same place, it just looks similar. That seems silly, but I, I swear I didn't see that path out before. Well, let's look for more lily pads. That, that's just the key, isn't it? Here, let's see what we can find. And if this doesn't work, I'm gonna uh, probably do the editing thing and find the right path because uh, you've probably watched me uh, walk around the same area a few times too many. Eh. Although I am having fun slaughtering bunnies. Wait, that came out wrong. Hey, no, it didn't. No, I'm having fun slaughtering bunnies. Right, yep. Yeah, lily pads. Fuck's sake. Okay. Well, now I know I can walk on the lily pads. We can progress. Okay, cool. I didn't know we could walk on the lily pads. Okay, let's try the holy ball. We're in the Holy Land, maybe the Holy Spells is the way forward. I still miss uh, Lumina, rather than, you know, Wisp, but whatever. Okay, that did even less. Alright, Air Blast. Let's try Air Blast. Air Blast! Come on, Sylphid. Good work. We should be on the other side of the pillar now? Yeah. See you later, kiddos. I love the idea of rabbits just chilling out in the Holy Land. There's just nothing but rabbits. Beautiful. It's like my favorite thing. I wish I could be no where someone nothing but rabbits. As long as I wear the biting kind, I just want a cuddly one. They are very cute. Eh. Pop. Pop. Pop, I say. No! 
Oh god! The Rabbit Rainstorm did so much damage, what the shit? Okay, let's uh, let's heal that off, shall we? Friggin' jerk bunny! Well, lot of uh, that is a lot of golden statues. I think it's telling me to save my game. All right. There we go. This goddess statue flows with the same energy as the mana stones. You can perform a class change here. Would you like to try? No, because we're not the right level. Okay. Well, that's interesting. So if we ever need to do a class change, we can just come here instead. Alright, well, it looks like we're still in the middle of bunny heaven, so let's kill some shit. Durin, kill some bunnies. Don't let the bunny cast bunny Armageddon. Rabbi Rainstorm is still the best thing I've ever seen. I want to be able to cast Rabbi Rainstorm, damn it. No, Rabbi! That's such a great spell. Okay, there's lily pads. Uh, take the lily pads. This was a wrong decision, and the lily pads have betrayed me now. First of all, you show me the path, then you betray me. Scumbag lily pads. It's fine, I don't want to lily your pad anyway. Jerks. No! No more bunnies! Oh, bunny! Don't let it cast again, it's deadly. Oh god, it's a black hole. Carly, protect me from the bunnies. The bunnies are apocalyptic. Ugh. If this is another friggin... Wait, that ogre box was different. That was a different coloured one. I guess that means it's a burlier ogre box. Maybe it's an oni box? Hey. Regular rabbi. Well, he's, he's dead. Come on, let's all just smack him up. Smack this rabbi up. Eh. Oop. Eh. There's a rebellion here somewhere? Apparently. Oh, there is. Silktail's still a better name. Just saying. Why do they make the holy man such a maze? It needs signposts. Someone obviously had to build this. God damn it. Oh, here we go. Found the tree. The Sword of Mana. Oh, we found it. I guess this is for you, Duran. Ow. Eek. Wait, slow down. Try it again. You waiting for me? Wait, I don't recognize that one. Where was that one? I guess this is the dramatic moment where all the stones are unleashed so we can pull the, the uh, sword out. You know, I've got this horrible suspicion that us taking so long to pull the sword out is going to come back to haunt us. I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm gonna have a drink. I see what we were going for here, but I feel they could have sped this up a smidge by not having to show every single one, but that's okay. Oh, I do love that forest tile set. It looks beautiful. It looks really comfy, doesn't it? Just like a place that like have a nice uh, lay down in the sun. Think about how much you've grown over this adventure, Angela. There we go. The legendary hero sword. Swing. 
sword of mana. I did it! I got the sword before mother! Fairy? Fairy, where are you? What do I do with this sword? I can't use swords. The hell's a fairy? Oh, hey, goddess. I am the image of the goddess of mana. Angela, hero of the sword, hear me. The fairy has been taken by an evil hand. The fairy was just here. Please save her. Wait a minute, if you're the goddess, weren't you supposed to grant our wishes? The power of mana is dying. The tree will wither soon and I will also be gone. I can't do anything for you, but I will give you this final gift. My heroes, Angela, Duran, Kali, let the mana guide you. Wait, I have so many questions. Windrum, too many items. Ugh. All right, let's store one of the items first then. Uh, what do we not need? Oh, we don't need the flute anymore, I think. So we'll put that into storage. Have a guess what the wind drum will do. I'm sure you won't guess what this does. We're we not in the right space. You need to be in a decent amount of space for this to work. I don't know if you can do it here. It seems to be odd to give you the drum and not let you use it here, but whatever. Oh, well, the goddess is pissed off. But we got the sword, which is good. Don't know what we're supposed to do with it, but... Hey, we got the sword before anyone else did. I guess we need to get to a clearing before we can use this. Let's go back to where the statues were. Well, the rabbits are gone. I guess with the sword, it's cleared them off. Well, let's save it quickly. Yeah, I'll save my game. We're sans a fairy, but you know. Still can't use the drum? Interesting. I wonder where I have to be to use this damn thing. It's interesting they, uh, they actually did it like this, where they give you the drum, but don't let you use it straight away. It could be we need to go back to the uh, beginning of the- Oh! Ah, that's why. Because, uh, there's stuff you need to see. Right. It's Death Jester. Huh. <sighs> Death Jester, did you kidnap the fairy? Oh, heavens no. If I had, I wouldn't be lollygagging around here. I'd be waiting behind you in ambush, preparing to take you with an element of surprise. What are you talking about? <laughs> no, but the real reason I'm here is to act as a messenger. My master, the masked mage, has been executed, and the Mirage Palace has been destroyed. The perpetrators of this most vicious crime are waiting for you at the entrance. They made me stay here to tell you and threaten death if I refuse. Well, they're probably going to kill me anyway, so I should take this opportunity to run. Ta-ta! No, what happened to Heath? Oh? Uh -huh. Well, he's a bit of a weirdo. The mass mage died and he was released from his curse or something. But he didn't seem to know who he was anymore. Then he just disappeared somewhere, like that. I haven't a clue what became of him. Is that enough? Well then, ta-ta. Oh, where did Heath go? Poor Heath. Don't worry, Heath. Carly will find him and take care of you. So now we're going to get a follow-up story, basically, to all the characters. I actually forgot about this bit. I forgot about a lot of this. I know Big U is here as well. And Jagen, he's down. Our master, the Dark Prince, planned to open the gate to the Manor Holy Land. He sacrificed himself to summon the Manor Stone of Darkness from the Underworld. After that, we plan to revive him with the Sword of Mana and merge both worlds together. But an unexpected adversary appeared, eliminating the Dark Prince's remains, and sealed his soul into eternal darkness. Not even the sword can help him now. Jagen thought we could at least obtain the sword and merge the two worlds, but I can't imagine what any world would be like without my Dark Prince. I will not allow his death to be stained by this never-ending disgrace. So with these hands, I killed Jagen. And now I too will follow after my Dark Prince. Goodbye. The Dark Prince was my everything. Ah, good old murder suicide. <laughs> Andrew just has nothing to say on that one. Like, damn. 
So it stands to reason, ho ho ho, that the Queen of Reason is the last one to run into. So let's go find her, shall we? Oh, it's down here, isn't it? Well, depending on which character you pick, I believe, depending on which major part of the story plays up next, so... In this case, it's this. <gasps> Corrin! Stop! Give back the fairy! Oh, Angela! All you ever do is whine, whine, whine. Have I told you that? Well, if you want the fairy back, you'll have to meet us in Altina. And bring the Sword of Mana. Hey, Corrin! Piece of shit! Ugh. Oh, mother, why are you such a shitbag? They couldn't pull out the sword by themselves, so they waited for us to do it. Oh, what do we do then? Even if it is a trap, I can't forgive mother for this. We have to go. I can use magic now, and I have the sword. I won't let them bully me around anymore. Let's go. Altina is waiting. Uh-huh. Flammy! We need you! <laughs> Beautiful. Now we can fly. A to send, B to descend. Swap the camera with this. Same as the old, same exactly the same as the old controls. So we're still on the Manor Holy Land. But the pure, this is the pure land from the first game, essentially. As you can tell, it's got the same look to it. But we need to get the hell out of here. So we find, I think we find the middle. And I think we actually I can't quite remember how we get out of here. I think we just fly out. Yeah. There we go. Cool. So this is Altina, but I think we should pay a quick visit. What is this place anyway? Let's have a quick look. I don't remember what this place is. Have we even been here? The glass desert. Ah, well we can't come here yet then. <laughs> oh Flammy, you're so great. Oh, I've accidentally hit the land button. Sorry, I'm so used to the other controls. That's my bad. My bad. It's okay. We get to watch the amazing Flammy animation again. Whee! And hop. That's so great. I love it. We definitely need to stock up on supplies, so... Uh, if we go to the town before Altina... Nice for Cena. I love it says your destination. That's, that's nice. Uh, this is the Moonlit Village, I guess? This is the... This is the... This is the Frosty Town, isn't it? Yeah. So we should be able to stock up, heal up, and do the rest of it here. Uh, that's the pub. Ah, see if there's any new items. There might be. I'm not 100% sure on that. Do, 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 do. Right. Uh, at the very least, getting some... Uh, getting some more goodies. Uh, oops. Let's get some more grass. It's poisoning is uh, devilry. Cool. Thank you very much. I don't think there's any other shops yet, but you never know. No, just the old stuff. Okay, we'll have a look. I think we're actually full after pulling out the sword, so I think we're actually okay to go. Alright. Peace out, everyone. We're gonna go on the back of a dragon. How cool is this? Way? Well, can't keep the Queen of Reason rating. Give her a reason to pain. Hey, let me in, dick bags. I got the sword. When Corrin came back to Altina, the monster started appearing. Oh, the fact that this is here means we probably can actually upgrade our stuff. I'm still fine. Well, that's good. I'm scared. That's not good. Will you sell me things? Against the Queen's wishes? Thanks. You might have anything. You might have some interest. No, he's got the same stuff. Okay. I want to see if we can find the, uh, 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 the weapon store, shall we? There should be one around here. Well, those are the battle mages. Aha! This is what I really want. I'm about to beat up the queen. Could you give me some shit? That'd be great. A zephyr robe. I love that. A protect ring. Partner. 
You can have that. Glint row. Protect earrings. Lovely. Pegasus armor. Beautiful. And a strength armor hand. Lovely. Good work, everyone. This is why having so much money is actually quite useful. We haven't really got to worry about uh, if we can afford everything. Hailstorm and Cat's Bulger. Cat's Bulger? That's an interesting one. Alright, let's get the Cat's Bulger because that seems to be the most. Uh, that's quite a big jump in damage, actually. The Skull Rod. Nice. And the Troll Maul. Nice! Oh, it's taken all my money, but hey, worth it. Right. Let's do our little equip run, shall we? So. Ugh. God, it's so slow equipping anything in this game. Oh, yeah, I forgot we got the cunning staff, but we got the skull rod now. Oh, don't want that. And the zephyr robe. And a protect ring. Lovely. And nothing in that one still. Next, we have the cat's bulger. We've got the pegasus armor. And of course, a strength armband. One troll mool. Uh, whoops. One glint robe, I believe. Yep. Uh, uh, and some protect earrings. Lovely. All right, we're good to go. Kick some ass. Take names and you know show dominance to the Queen of Reason. Let me in, you piece of shit. Monsters in the castle. We're overrun by monsters. Well, this is your own bloody fault. This is what you get for following a nutter. All right, let's go beat up some monsters in the castle, shall we? What up, knobs? Alright, magic dudes. I don't know what we're gonna kick. Let's let's kick their ass. Let's start with the old tried and true classic method of uh, if it bleeds, we'll kill it with diamonds because diamonds are freaking hardcore. Nice. Uh. Uh. Hey, that's my job. Don't you attack Carly with that. She's fine. You suck. You suck at your job. That's a nice lava XP. I know I was supposed to explore the castle at the start of the game, but it's been a while and I don't quite remember where we're going. So probably to the throne room, if we're being honest, but... Alright, let's let's attack the uh, head. The, there we go. Unicorn head's in there now. Right. I think some of these are devilry, so I'm going to try uh, Holy Ball. Because if, if the class is devilry, then this might work better. Didn't seem to do an awful lot, but oh, there's another one over there. Bonk. Again, fighting through an area with tons of oh god, evil gate. Ugh. Oh, it's an Angela. Angela can take evil gates to the face. Look at that, forty. Haha, <laughs> she says, my face is not even stained by your evil gate. Oh, nice. Right, we're definitely upstairs here because you know I'm an expert. And I can see the stairs. So let's heal and continue onwards. There is a chest there. I should probably get that. Eh. That one has a Reaper on it. Oh, I don't like the look of that. An Undine statue. Oh, nice. Starting to get decent things on these chests. This looks especially like... Oh, a round drop. Uh, let's get back upstairs then. Try the other stairwell. Friggin' storeroom. No, they're both storerooms, okay. Then this led to where the cook was, I think, now, so let's go to the kitchens. Yeah. Eh. Alright, I still don't remember, but we're going to use Diamond Missile because I like it the most. Oh, wait, is it Diamond Missile that doesn't do anything on the machine gun? because they're made out of uh, the, the, the class is dwarf and... Yeah, they're dwarf and so it doesn't work. Right, so we don't want to use Gem Missile on the machine gun. That was it. Actually, for the for these days, we usually use Carly and you uh, have her use um, machine golem on the wizard. Kick his ass! Stop evil gating people at like the drop of a hat. I have a cast time, unlike you, jackass. Okay, get machine golemed. Wee. There we go. Okay, so we need to use something that isn't that. Let's let's I don't know. Let's go for evil gate. I believe. Evil game time! Whoop, 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 whoop. Yeah, that works a bit better. Hey, I literally just did that. You can't do the thing I just did. That is against video game rules. Mine was cooler. Let's 
kick his ass. Yeah. Random chest piece here to beat it up. Which health we got? Ah, I think we're done alright for now. We've made it downstairs by the looks of it, I think. Yeah. Nope. I have no idea, no idea where the hell we're going. I really don't. Let's go to Santa Dylan. Have I, have I made it back to the correct place? Have I just looped on myself? That's illegal, and I will not have my leotard burnt by the likes of you. So, uh, I'm gonna do... Actually, I'm gonna do something. Uh, I'm gonna do wind magic, because it should get the golem. It should toast the golem real bad. If he's earth, it should wind should really wreck it, actually. Yeah, 150, yeah, cool. Okay, these are shut, so... I have... I ain't the foggiest where the hell I'm supposed to be going. Right, just whack the wizard till it dies. Don't let him cast! There we go. That was a machine gun there, that's nice. Oh god! Okay, good. There's a note on the table. Right, uh... Probably need to heal at this point, I guess. Looking a bit shifty. Thank you very much! Oh yeah, we we've actually we have actually made it round to the right place. That that's nice. Duran, go go wet the wizard before he starts casting anything, would you? That's one thing I, one thing that was nice about the original is that you, uh, like a casting enemy, you could actually keep stunned a bit easier. Okay, I guess we just go through one of these doors. I wonder if I could save on those mana statues. I need to quickly check that actually, because uh, if I can save on those statues, that might save me some pain in a minute. Oh nice, we leveled up again. Uh, yeah, let's get some more strength going. Honestly, having strength is so useful when you're just auto attacking. Uh, let's have you with some vitality actually. Eh. Oh, a Jin statue. Nice. Right, let's see if we can save on this statue. In theory, we should be able to. No? No, it's actually just background decoration. Okay. Excuse me, I'm looking for a fairy. Has anyone seen one? What a nuisance. Eh, stop it. Stop, stop it. Stop, stop it. Wait, is this not where we just was? Am I am I imagining things, or have we just have we looped? I think we've looped. I think I've made a mistake somewhere. Someone's designed this castle to look exactly the same. Really, you're gonna cast twice in quick succession like that? You're just gonna you're just gonna chain cast me? Is that is that is that what people do in polite society? Is it? Uh, more int for you for more damage, I guess. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Is this the kitchens? Damn it! I've looped. Okay. Clearly, this has not not gone well. We've gone round in the circle. Let's go back the way we came. There's got to be a way here that doesn't involve. Who designs these friggin' castles? What is wrong with having a direct route to the throne room? I guess if you're, I guess if you're invading, you don't want a direct route to the throne room, I suppose. I can kind of see the logic behind that, but still. Okay, so we're back here again. Maybe that is the main room, but they've, they've sort of locked it off, haven't they? So that's, uh... Wow, they're all grouped up, so we can just beat them up like this. That's really useful. Oh, another, another chubby fairy statue. Well, we achieved a lot there. That was good. I'm actually going to go to the end, because fuck it. Like, we, we just went around in the circle. Oh, that was weird. Uh, oh, there's an old person. The manor is disappearing. Yeah, it is. I'm trying to fix it. Your stupid queen's ruining everything, though. Even with the castle like this, I can't close up shop. Everyone will be disappointed. Anything for me to do is do business as usual. Look at these flowers I've got, aren't they nice? 
Can I open my flowers? I don't like your flowers, they suck. I need to get to the inn. <laughs> will you be staying with us tonight? Yes, please. Good night. Enjoy your stay. Oh, I will. It's only apocalyptic out there. Alright, I'm actually going to stop it here because uh, it makes sense. Like, the castle's going to be quite long and we achieved Zippo because I went the wrong way. So, thank you for watching. A lot has happened this set. A lot of story stuff's happened. Two out of the three of the main antagonists seem to have uh, booked it, at least for now. And, uh, well, we got to go find Corrin and uh, get the fairy back. But we do have the Sword of Mana, which is a good start. So, thank you very much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you all next time. Ta-da!